Hey Shalom YouTube. Hey guys, it's Fletch. So uh, this video, as you might be able to tell from the title, is kind of a, a continuation of the past video, but I didn't want it to be like 15 minutes. So, um, <clears throat> Judeo-Christian values. So believe it or not, you know, the founding fathers of this country, you know, even with their many failures, and uh, you know things that they initially got wrong that had to be corrected and whatnot. Um, <clears throat> whether some people in our society like it or not, was indeed founded on Judeo, what is modern day called Judeo-Christian values. Okay, so where do those Judeo-Christian values come from? Well, the Ten Commandments. Okay, well. Um, where did the Ten Commandments come from? Well, from the Bible. They're supposed to be God's Word. You know, Yah, the Heavenly Father, Yahweh, Yahuwah, you know, however you think His name should be pronunciated. Uh, you know, every time in the Bible you see the word Lord on all capital letters, that's the te Tetragrammaton, you know, uh, Y-H-W-H, and you know, it signifies, you know, the quote-unquote one true God. And guys, when I say quote-unquote one true God, I'm not saying that I don't believe that. I'm just saying that this is going out on YouTube, and so not everyone agrees with that value system. And you don't have to agree with that either, obviously. So you know where I'm coming from when I say things like that. But the laws of this land are loosely based on the Ten Commandments. And one step further than that, they are also based on uh, the law, quote unquote, that we've all, in modern, modern day Christianity, we've all been taught, well, that was nailed to the cross. Okay. <clears throat> but anyways, having said that, uh, we find ourselves living in a time when all of those laws have been done away with and our, our society continues to, you know, uh, increasingly faster and faster go down a slippery slope because of that, in my opinion. There's a reason why the creator of the universe told us that every matter must be established by two or three witnesses and the whole purpose of the the Ten Commandment do not bear false witness against your brother is because it required two or three witnesses for you to be uh, you know in modern-day terms adjudicated for any offense of the law eyewitnesses people that actually saw it happen and so, you know, the, the mainstream media, the more, more precisely the uh, loony left liberal media, keeps doing their best to uh, take pot shots at, at Trump by una unanimous, <laughs> anonymous, I can't talk today, anonymous sources. And something that I just wanted to kind of bring to your attention is that if you are someone that supposedly espouses to a belief and value system that are based off of that foundation and you're out there repeating this story about President Trump calling these countries you know, crapples, I'm not going to use the, the real word, but just because there's people that I know listen to my videos with their children in the room, so uh, I don't have a problem, personally, I don't have a problem saying those words, but I want to honor them since I know that some of them have their children in the room. So, if, and again, if you are repeating this story and, you know, posting stuff on Facebook and all this, and quoting President Trump as if it's a fact that he said that, I would highly encourage you to take a step back, contemplatively and critically 
think about that and you know if that's something that the creator of the universe would want you to do and obviously if you don't espouse that value system doesn't apply to you right go about doing what you do you know you do you I'll do me we're all good as long as you're not hurting innocent people and children so on and so forth so uh, for whatever it's worth hopefully this is a blessing to someone out there and uh, you know in my opinion some of you out there you need to check yourself 